What's going on guys, it's Lois, and I'm back with another Minecraft tutorial. And today's video, I'll be going back to the uh, redstone hidden staircase, because some of you guys have commented on actually how to, when I'm entering the whole um, base, how do I actually close it from when I'm actually in the Secret Lord base? And today I'll be showing you uh, two solutions on how to um, close it up when you're actually inside the base. So virtually where no one can see you once you're in down there. So one way is using a two-way lever. It's just an added uh, two-way mechanic over here, which I will show you. Uh, yeah, pretty much just entering down below, hitting this lever, and it's all closed up. It's, no one can see you when you're in your little secret base, armory, or whatever it is you're doing. And then another way is using a T flip-flop, um, using a button. So a button's more concealed that way, if that's what you like to choose. Um, yeah, it's pretty straightforward. The only downside about buttons is, you know, it's a slight delay compared to the lever, whereas it's straight away. The only downside of the lever is that it's, well, it's not as hidden as the button, so it's up to you whether you want to do. Uh, yeah, I'll be showing you guys the two solutions. If you haven't seen the recent video stone staircase, I'll be showing you how to do it. If you guys already know how to build this, just skip uh, to the part where um, I'm doing the two solutions here. So let's get started. All right, so to get started, we're gonna need a rough area of 13 by nine and then up by six. Uh, so what the materials we're gonna need for both um, solutions and the, obviously the, the redstone, we're gonna need any choice of stairs, sticky piston, redstone, Slime block, honey block, redstone repeaters, obsidian, any choice of block, uh, stone button, levers, uh, black carpet, or black wool, or any choice of color of wool. I'll just chose black. Red, uh, block of redstone and then a two by two area. Place down two obsidian blocks. Place another two by two of sticky pistons. And then another two blocks of obsidian. And now we don't really need obsidian for anything else. Alright, so then we're going to need slime blocks, honey blocks, and then your choice of stairs. There we go. Choice of block. I'm going to go up by 2x2 two by two like this. Make a little C shape. Do the same with the other side. Alright, so now we're going to need our redstone repeaters, forcing it, uh, facing them into the pistons. Like that. And then two clicks delay over here, and two clicks delay over here, and then one, two, three over here. Redstone dust. Oops. I'm just going to do that for now. And then the same thing on the other side. Two clicks, two clicks, one, two, three. And virtually, once we have done this step, we can just test out our Contraption, it should work, as you can see. That's our first step. Um, so you're gonna keep this on. I'm just gonna line up with, and make our second set of stairs. I'm just gonna dig into the ground, put sticky pistons here. And then we're gonna put slime block, honey block, staircase, staircase, staircase. And I'm just gonna break that. I'm gonna break this now. Now we're going to get our redstone facing this way, like so. And then we're going to break the blocks here, down below, and connect them up. Actually, do that. We're going to break a block down there, and then put a redstone repeater just here. So just boost the um boost the power a little bit. And then again that should work again. There we go. And now we're gonna do the actual floor. So what we're gonna need is a black wool, black carpet, and the block of choice. So so keep it keep it on for now so we can know what we're working what we're working with. Five blocks, one, two, three, four, five. And again on the other side. And then we're going to put our sticky pistons facing towards the black wall. And then just line it up. Like this. 
Should be like that, and the same with the other side. All right, now we're going to deactivate this thing because now we're going to put our redstone torches down. Do the same on the other side. All right, so once we've got that done, we can put our repeaters in. So go one bit down below and then do a two. Um, Two by five repeaters, Oop. and then redstone dust, just like that. Same with the other side. And then redstone. Alrighty, and then I'll just I'll fill up a little bit, do a bit of black wool around it. All right, and then we're gonna use our black carpet, basically fill all of it, except for the, this part in the middle here. And so on this point here, we're just gonna get our choice of block again, and we're gonna make a little staircase for our, our redstone. And then that should connect straight to there, same on the other side. Yeah, it looks a lot better. All right, so and I'm just going to test it out. Now it should all work, as you can see. Now I'm just going to put a little staircase here, makes it all cleaned up, and then I'm just going to fill this up just to the po point where the stairs um, touch. I'm just going to fill this up. And now we're up we're up to the part where we can put our two-way lever or by choice we can put our um, our T flip flop with the, the button. Alright, so there's two choices. We can use the two-way lever. This is just an example. Um, so that's our that's it say this is our hidden staircase. That's one that's one way uh, our one lever here over here. Yeah, we turn it off and on wherever. And the other side we can do the same. And then over here, we've got the T flip flop. Uh, two buttons over here. Again, this is also a slight delay. Um, yeah. So we're going to start with the two-way lever. All right, guys. To do the two-way lever, we're going to need to put two redstone, and then one next like that. Put your choice of block just like that, and then a sticky piss in just just like this, and then two repeaters side by side just like that. Sticky piss in here redstone block there and then put a repeater just there all right so we're just going to set up our, our lever i'm just going to put basically another wall here chuck a lever right here and then just set up our redstone going all the way through um just putting it facing the piston and then we're going to make our trail for the lever going up here i'm just going to extend the black wool here Putting carpet, so a level will be sitting just here, and then our finishing point will be right there. So, make a staircase like that. Essentially, uh, it should work like so. This will be closed up. And that is how to make the two-way lever. Now I'll be showing. I'm just going to break this part now and do the uh, T flip flop with the button. All right, guys. So to do the T flip flop, we're going to need to do, start from here. One, two, three. Put a piston just here. Another one, just like that. Put a redstone uh, block of redstone just there. Block of choice. Two up top. One down below. Put the redstone across. One going out. All the way down the staircase, meeting up with this button here. And then not only going out, 
many up with this. Like that. And I'm going to put our two redstone torches here. Like so. Now if we click this, it should close up, let's click it again, it should open, and then, you know, as soon as we go here, oh, I'm going to put a button right here, and it should all work. So hopefully you guys have enjoyed this video, I've tried to comment, um, reply to your comments in the comment section, and um, yeah, I've came back with another video on showing the tutorial, uh, please don't hesitate to comment. Um, Below any troubles or anything like that and uh, yeah for the next video um, I've got all these tutorials to do in the future and yeah just any suggestions on the next video that'll be that'll be great uh, please like this video and subscribe for more content like this <laughs>